everybody, welcome back. Listen, we love wearing Buffalo attire because we're all proud of where we come from, but did you know you can wear a great shirt and have it help a local charity? Well, that's what 26 Shirts is all about. Del Reed is here to tell us more. Del, you started this, what, in 2013? Yeah, I started it in 2013 as what was going to be a one-year community service project, and it just really took off. Yeah. And now uh, we're about five and a half years into doing it. Well, now look, at we have Courtney. She's modeling one of your shirts. Is that this year's shirt? That's the current shirt we're selling right now. We sell, The reason mm -hmm. that we're called 26 shirts is because we sell a different limited edition t-shirt every two weeks. I see. 52 divided by 2 is 26. Mm -hmm. Courtney uh, offered to model this shirt for yeah. us, and it actually, its two-week run is coming to an end. It actually finishes Sunday. Okay, so if you want this shirt, you have to hurry up and order it. Um, you started this, we said, just a few years ago, but you sell more apparel than just a t-shirt if you want, let's say, a hoodie or something. Oh, yeah, we have we have hoodies and tank tops, and we just started selling the uh, the flowy racer back tanks that women love. I, I, I was never really familiar with those, but we offered them and um, posted on Twitter, and women started like tweeting back, like, oh, this is so great. So uh, we do our best to make sure that we get something that everybody wants. And here's the best part, everybody. Not only did you get the shirt, but through that, you've raised over $600,000 for local people and local charities, right? That's right, yeah, we exist to help. You know, the t-shirts are the fun part about it, but the reason that we actually exist is because we want to help local families that have, you know, serious issues going on that they need help paying uh, medical bills or whatever. And then also there's a lot of worthy nonprofits that we want to draw attention to. Yes, as a matter of fact, the, the, the shirt that uh, Courtney is wearing uh, supports the American Cancer Society's Making Strides for Breast Cancer. That's right, yeah. Yeah, yeah we've, um, we actually have a pretty long waiting list in terms of people who are waiting for help and, you know, nonprofits. So um, American Cancer Society was very patient. It's been a little over a year and a half since they've been waiting for their, you know, two-week run. We're able to do it now, and we're really excited for how it's performing. Dale, how much, let's say, would that shirt be that Courtney's got on? Uh, the shirts run twenty-six dollars, okay. and then as you know, as you go up, obviously hoodies are a little bit more expensive mm -hmm. than that. But, but that's, that's still the, very reasonable. Yeah, it's, it's in line with current market cost, right. and then we do our best to, um, you know, make everything work because we're donating a large portion of that, right. you know, to the different charities that we're helping. That's fantastic. That is that is really great. Tell us how people can find your line of apparel, where they can go ahead and choose and then make a purchase. Yeah, it's just twenty-six shirts.com. Uh, we have, you know, we're based in Buffalo. About 90% of what we do is Buffalo based, but we also have a Pittsburgh line and a Chicago line as well. It's all run out of here. So if you have a, uh, a family member that maybe is, um, for some reason, a Bears fan or a Steelers fan or, yeah, or whatever. For some reason, yeah. Yeah, right. <laughs> uh, we have different apparel insp inspired by those teams as well, too, that, you know, that can give back to causes in those cities. Now, Del, what if they, 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 they didn't order the shirt in a timely manner? Can you go back? Well, that's the whole thing, right? Where they're limited editions, right. and once a once a shirt's campaign is over with, we're on to the next design. Mm -hmm. We're on to the next uh, beneficiary. So you really have to move on it. Now we bring designs back now mm -hmm. and then as our comeback campaigns, but really you have the two weeks to order the shirt, and then after that, it's you know gone with the wind. Well, I have to tell you, my son bought the Pancho Bila shirt after that uh, gentleman passed away, and it was first of all, it was a beautiful shirt. It was a lo lovely quality, and every time I see it, I, I, I think of that gentleman, and it's nice to know that that went to charity. Yeah, know? yeah, that, that, see, that's a funny exception, is the poncho shirt, along with the shirt I'm wearing today, mm -hmm. uh, they, both those designs proved to be so popular that they're brought back permanently. So we have a couple designs that you can buy all the time, and ponchos is one of them, and every time you buy a poncho shirt, it goes back to his family. All right, 26 shirts, we love it. 26shirts.com? 26shirts.com. That's all you gotta do. All right, everybody, listen, we're gonna be heading out to the Taste of Buffalo in a little while. We hope to see you there. Stop in at our Channel 7 booth uh, right around Niagara Square, uh, right near the Statler, and say hi. Dell, thanks so much. Have a great weekend. Oh, you too, thank you. All right, everybody. Have a wonderful, wonderful next two days.